Hello. Good morning. It is nine o'clock on Tuesday morning. I had a bit of line this morning and uh, now I'm going to do a bit of training. I'm going to do a gym session and a running session. So cracked out a good gym session and um, cracked out a good little 20 minute run as well, feeling quite good. I feel really warm now, like really red, am I really red? I always go bright red after I run, I don't know why. The river's looking quite nice today. But summer just isn't here, like where is summer? What up ducks? It's not cold, but it's just not, it's not summer is it? So I've got about another week or two before we fly out to the European Championships in Portugal. So yeah, just pushing through training really for that last little bit. And then after Portugal I'm going straight to Cape Town, so that'll be awesome. Oh. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, crazy hair. Crazy. Okay, list of things what I need doing for the rest of the day. I've got to make a load of stickers. I've got to edit two video blogs. I've got to post a shitload of jumpers and hoodies and t-shirts that y'all have been buying. I've also got to make more swallow stickers because you guys have been going crazy for those. Thank you so much for buying them. <laughs> Probably have a nap because I'll be knackered by then. And then later on this afternoon, I'm heading over to Johnny Schofield and Rachel Cawthorn's house to have a braai which they probably will be calling a barbecue because we're not in South Africa. So that'd be really nice catching up with all those guys. They've just got back from their two Sprint World Cups, which I commentated on, so it should be quite amusing. And now I'm just talking crap. <laughs> cool, so here I am just working at home. And who decides to phone me? None other than Food for Louis, Louis Cole. Any of you guys that are into YouTube, you probably know Louis from uh, his Food for Louis channel where he eats crazy stuff, but I'll put a link in the description for you. He's now got a channel called Fun for Louis as well where he just travels around and does cool stuff. He's been in Uganda for a week, so he's probably going to have a better tan than me. Cafe, flowers again. Taking Louis in there. <laughs> vlogging, you This croque monsieur will, will change your life. It will blow your mind. Will it? Yeah. It's a bit, it's a toaster. It's not just a toaster. <laughs> <laughs> this is a next level toasty. Alright, cool, it's time to say goodbye to uh, Louis and Steve. <laughs> So now my plans are, I'm going to go and post a load of uh, jumpers and t-shirts and then I'm going to make my way over to Maidenhead because I'm going to have a barbecue with them tonight which is going to be super fun. <laughs> hey man. Hello. How are you? Very well. Good man.
Well, that was nice seeing everybody having a little barbecue and a catch up. Um, such a nice group of people, such a good group of friends that I've got. And uh, it's cool because when you don't see them for a while, you've got more to talk about, I think. And you know you've got some good friends when things aren't different, when you haven't seen them for a long time. And uh, yeah, I just feel super lucky to have such a good little group of friends from canoeing. <laughs> Well, I'm home now, so uh, this is me saying adios over and out from me. Um, be nice to people, work hard, and don't get lost or killed. Okay, bye.